Hi, my name's Eliza. Um, I'm a PT here at Lux, and this is my story about mental health. My mental health, I have never actually gotten help for my mental health, so I'm not entirely sure, like, a diagnosis wise, but I've always kind of been positive and upbeat, and people have always kind of said that about me, and I've always aimed to be like that. And then I kind of meant that when I did get the low moments in life, when I did struggle moving the house, being at university, being on my own, whatever it was, I ended up feeling like I couldn't express my feelings because I was not gonna be this persona that I, I wanted to be and other people saw me as. I was gonna, you know, spoil it. So I just, didn't, I felt like I couldn't really express myself and that I wasn't being true to myself by, by even though I kind of would have been more true to myself if I had just expressed myself. But I, I just found it difficult and so I put up a front basically. I've been in the fitness industry for a while just like as on the other side of it as an athlete since I was 12 and I think if I hadn't had that I think you know going but I think it would have turned out very differently and that actually it kept me it kept me going it always like meant that I had I was surrounded by a team um, which meant that I was surrounded by people that really did support you and were going through similar struggles at similar ages. Um, so I, I, I'm a big person for like sports and getting involved in sports. Um, and then in here, actually what I found the most is obviously people tell you like, as a personal trainer, you'll probably help people like physically and mentally. But the amount it's helped me as well mentally, just like speaking to people, my clients, just being able to relate to someone, being able to share your experiences and then hear, hear them. And they, they're not a complete stranger, but they're not, a close circle and sometimes actually that's easier than speaking to someone like super close to you so I found it yeah just amazing.